to the new vlog. Hello, how are you doing today? Welcome back to the vlog. It's a good day. So I'm I'm um, alone. <laughs> I'm alone, <laughs> and that's not like I'm alone. I mean, I'm not currently in a relationship. What's completely fine? Valentine's Day is coming up. I believe on Monday, possibly. I don't know. I'm Valentine's Day is a weird day. I'm not sure how I feel about Valentine's Day. It's um, Valentine's Day is on this way, and um, Max is still single. Obviously, something needs to be changed about this. How can this How can this be single? Have you seen me in a tuxedo? That would be surprising if you did, because I've never owned a tuxedo in my life. Pretty weird if you said yes. So some of you may be aware there's a show called Take Me Out here in the UK. I'm currently at university, and at the University of York we split into different colleges. As I said, I am from Langwith. And within your colleges, you have different colleges, teams where you can do different activities. Usually, you'll be able to do different activities. Unfortunately, coronavirus has not allowed us to do that. Online events still go ahead, and there's one tonight that I'm taking part in, and this is Langwith's Take Me Out. So the whole event is in sponsorship of Student Minds, um, UK, specifically Student Minds York, and I've worked with Student Minds uh, on uh, numerous of projects uh, that I've done with the uni. What am I doing to myself? That's what I'm doing tonight. Zoom online take me out that I have no idea about because I have only been given a link and that's it. I've been given a link and a time and the time to join the link. I haven't got anything prepared. So if they ask for anything prepared, I am screwed of it. These are the highs and lows of university for <laughs> highs and lows of university life at the moment. Being rejected by people in an online Zoom call. <laughs> Why am I nervous? Why am I nervous? For? Grow up. Grow up. You're gonna be fine. I'm gonna chuck everything on the floor. It's not what I thought it was. This is fun. I just got out of the shower, so I look like a sewage rat. I know. Leave me alone. But, um, um, I did not find love last night. I was fine. I wasn't expecting to find love. It just, um, it was alright. It just wasn't what I was expecting. Nonetheless, it was for charity. So, go donate to Student Minds. They're a great charity. And they're lovely people. Talking of lovely people, I need to check out some of my lectures for my modules. No, no, you're lying. Yeah, you're actually lying. What? What? <laughs> right, so I have a film festival um, awards night. And these are the Moving Image Awards. They're quite big. They're, they're a big thing. They're a big deal. I was lucky enough to be selected this year and been nominated for an award. They just announced the lineup for the people who are doing, giving out the awards and doing speeches. And um, Edgar Wright's on there. And if you know me and you've been watching my videos, you probably know how much of a big deal this is. Because Edgar Wright has not only been my biggest inspirations, but also he's probably one of the reasons why I took film in the first place. Um, the amount of times I've watched his films, the amount of times I've studied his films, the amount of times I've, I've taken parts of his films that I liked, developed it into my own thing. I can't process this. The fact that he could have seen my film and he could be giving me an award and he, it's the biggest mind. I need to swear. <laughs> I need to swear. I wrote him like a letter in like year 11 and you can ask my friend Joe about this because he made fun of me for it. Screw you Joe. <laughs> no, I'm joking. It was very strange. I need my coffee. And Michael Sheen's gonna be there. What the? Toy Story cards today. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? I'm not gonna be around the bush here. This vlog after all is supposed to be an accurate representation of how I'm feeling at this moment in time in my life. And um, at this exact moment, I am um, missing my sister. I miss, I miss Abby. But no, there's, there's times like this in my life where a lot is changing and I always feel like, um, uh, you know, I feel like Abby's, Abby's missing out and I'd really like her to see this or I'd really like to, her to be here to help me through this. And so it's just the silly things like shopping and uni life and getting through it all. But um, that's the honesty tea, honest tea. It's the honest tea for today. Talk about your emotions to your friends. Just do it. Like a carer, or your parents, or a sibling, or your best mate. Being honest with how you feel is one of the most important things. And that's a straight fact. No printer, just facts. I'm gonna get a new book. I haven't read a single page of this one. I'm already looking at new books. I don't even read books. I have a problem. I have such a big problem. <laughs> Feel free to pop me a message. My social medias are down below and you can do that. That's completely fine. That's all for today. Thank you for watching and goodbye.